All right, guys, how's it going? Um, so I was having some issues with my AK9B programmer for my EWS key. I was trying to get a copy made, but I couldn't get the setup file to load correctly. So what I did was I downloaded the setup file and all of, or the whole file to my desktop. And then once you click on the setup file, it would bring up the administrator page, but it wouldn't actually run through. So to fix that, you're going to click the Windows key and the R key at the same time. That's gonna bring up this page. You type in services.msc, click OK. Then you're going to scroll down in here until you find Windows Installer. Little too far there. So once you find Windows Installer, you're gonna right click on it and it's gonna say start right here. You click that. So once that's started, you wanna go down to your bar at the bottom and right click on that, open up your task manager, and then you want to search through here for something that's going to say setup. Um, it says something along the lines of setup and then 32-bit. You wanna look for any of those and make sure that you right click on those and end those tasks and all of them because if you don't do that, this next process won't work. So once you've got that done and you have your Windows installer going, you can exit out of this page, go back to your AK90 software, and then right click on the setup tab and run it as an administrator. And then that should get the setup to run properly. So once you have the program installed and you're trying to read your EWS, also, make sure you test both of your old key and the new key that you're trying to program before you read your EWS. But once you're trying to read your EWS, you might get an issue that says pin touch error. So you wanna make sure that the dot on the connector is lined up with the dot on the EWS unit. And what I did is I put a sock down so that it was a little bit softer and I had to really firmly hold this down. And what I did is I grabbed it on both sides of the table and I held it down the whole time it was reading the EWS. And that got rid of the pen touch error. And then I saved the file and then I was able to go directly to the right key button and write the new key. And I just got done testing it and it works awesome. So hopefully this helps you guys. And I'm sorry for the crappy video quality, but again, hope it helps. Have a good one guys.